What's up, you guys? Chet Guthrie, the Dream Poet. And this makes day five. Day five? Day five of my vlogging series here in the wonderful state of Florida. And I thought, in celebration of my fifth video, and so far keeping up with it to what I said I was going to do, I will tell you all how I'm doing. How's he doing? Don't know. I will tell you all how I'm doing right now. As of late, things are going pretty good. I've gotten moved in to my boat. I'm making progress at my job. But still, I do not want to be here forever. But I am looking into what my actual career job is. Which is journalism, video production, that good stuff. So, everything is going well there. I'm working, as you all know, on the interior of my boat, and I'm getting pretty far. Um, one of the things that I'm going to fix, as I've said before, is I'm going to work on the ceiling probably here on Monday. I will be scrubbing the other half of my boat and getting it completely white, and I'm really looking forward to getting it running. Family, for all those who watch my channel, my family, thank you all for your love and support. It means a lot to me. I know I have a few family members. I think my grandfather has told me that I would get shystered down here, as he put it. But I'm going to make it work. I'm going to continue to make it work. And I'm kind of excited. I think sometime during this vlogging series, I'm going to film... None other than the Eileen Warnos, I think it's Eileen Warn the Eileen Warnos um, sites. I'm going to try to do that within the first couple of months. But really, these videos that I will be doing here lately and here to come will just be me on my daily walk and my daily venture through the wonderful state of Florida for one whole year. And if anyone has any questions, just let me know. Just hit me up. Um, I'm going to try to come back home anywhere between three weeks to two months. You know, it'd be good to see friends and family, but I, I just had to get out. But I'm excited. This was worth it. I want to see Endgame really bad, but as of right now, I do not have the money to see it. But I will probably see it next week. I am looking forward to that. I have heard nothing but good rumors about Endgame. And I think really this is the only video... Not the only video. The only movie that I refuse to watch any... Any... Spoiler videos that I would normally watch... Before going to see a movie. Yes, I am one of those kind of people. But I can't. I mean, I think it's only been out like maybe two days and the movie's already grossed like a billion dollars. So, I'm going to keep up to that. I think I might do a vlog of my review of the movie. I know that was one of the things that I wanted to do when I started this channel and really started getting in-depth with the Florida vlogging saga. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Um, I did a little bit of writing, and that's something that will come up in a later vlog. I'm going to talk a bit more about why I write, and I, I mean, a lot of friends of mine, a lot of family, and a lot of fans, they probably, they know that I write, and I'm very talented, but I will shed some light in a later video, but for this video, I just wanted to touch base with everyone on how everything's going. Florida is amazing. Admittedly, there is a lot of old people. No offense to old people. There is just a lot of old people. So that stereotype is a thing. Old people are around in this part of Florida. But one of the things that I noticed that is not a stereo or that is a stereotype that I have not noticed yet is some people in Florida can be jerks. I haven't really seen that. Everybody has been really kind. 
So to my friends that said that everybody's a jerk down here, it's eh, not, not so much. Now the price of living, that is a stereotype. About the average apartment where I'm at is about 900 a month. But with my sailboat, and when I get it moved to another marina, we'll, we'll be around 400. But still, I mean, I'd much rather live on a boat than live on an apartment. So, I'm just going to touch base with space. <laughs> I was going to touch base with you guys. This makes vlog number five. I wanted to tell everybody how I'm doing. This experience has been great so far. I mean, I will have my bad days and I will have my good days. And I still want to achieve my dreams of one day having my own television show. But thank you all for your love and support. Keep in touch with me at Dream Poet at Facebook and at my Instagram in the link below. Love you all for the love and support. I love you all very much. Stay tuned. This adventure is just getting real. Peace, you guys.